Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. And there's Porter at you. Just give me some footage on uh, Thanksgiving afternoon at Ruggles Station. See what's going on in the city. I'm not too sure, like, who they are. Could be um, they're kind of blocking the buses from making that turn as well. <clears throat> so this is about one o'clock on a Thanksgiving um, afternoon at Ruggles T Station. A lot of police activity in the area and um, looks like FBI and some other agencies over there as well. Boston Police and uh, I can't make out that other agency. It could be ATF. Could be ATF, I'm not sure. But it's about it's a multiple different units that are in the um, in the area. sure exactly like what took place but it's always good to report what you see in public so we can later on document it to make sure that things are being documented this is part of the One civilian review board this is part of documentation Give you better footage of what's going on. I'm trying to, um, I was trying to stream on my other camera. I couldn't get it set it up uh, fast enough, so I figure I stream off for this one. So um, just to give you some footage and documentation of what's going on in the city. So that it looks like those are FBI agents. At least that's what it says on your jacket, anyway. Um, what they're doing in I have no idea. Um, it's like a combination of FBI, Boston, and another agency. Can't make out the other agency there, but we'll figure it out in the, afterwards. Like I said, this, um, this happened like around like one o'clock, I should say, on a Thanksgiving uh, afternoon. This thing here is definitely doing something different. Change a couple of settings over here, very quick. Uh, 
get this. I have that. Still saying something different on there. I could figure it out later on. I said I'm not too sure what happened. I just know there was multiple uh, unmarked cruisers that converged on this area simultaneously. And um, they do have one suspect that we know of that's in uh, custody. What he did, um, we're not sure. Um, every, everybody has the presumption of innocent into proving guilty. So we're not too sure. That's the other unmarked cars over there that are parked further down. Now, what he did, I have no idea. But we're going to um, just keep an eye on things, just to make sure things are on the up and the up. Um, can't quite sure tell you exactly what happened, but nevertheless, it's something. So, um, they're, they're all about to clear out of here now. So, like I said, I'm not too sure exactly what happened, but I guess that suspect is going inside that vehicle, and all the other units are, are clearing out. But, I'm not too sure. I don't know why this camera's. This camera's doing something weird, but hopefully the footage comes out decent. Can't quite Let's see this change or something. Nope. Hmm. Something I gotta fix it later on, I guess. Hmm. Oh yeah, I see what's going on. I gotta reset this. This is not it's not gonna do what I want it to do. But nevertheless we have um we have we had a multiple FBI agents and it looked like Boston police and another agency. I can't make up what the other agency was if it was, but it was definitely a different agency unfamiliar with. And This, this is happening on uh, Thursday uh, Thursday afternoon. What happens in the city, you got to report what you see. Um, I don't know what they were doing or why they were over here, but I do know they took one person into custody. Now, whether he's guilty or something, we don't know. Whether he committed a crime, we don't know. But we do know that one person was apprehended and he is, uh, I'm not sure if he's in FBI custody or Boston police custody, but it looks like FBI was the primary, uh, the primary people involved. Um, so that's all for today. I figure I'd do a little footage on my way down the street, seeing what I can see in the city. And next time, guys, Nez Porter, signing out.